Good morning, everyone. My name is Isiaka Adeoye. I shall be taking you Zoom online class teacher. Topic Zoom classroom. Subtopic sign up to the class. The objective of this lesson is at the end of the lesson, the teacher should be able to sign up free on Zoom. Share any educative material with the students. Use Zoom to take class to take their class remotely. What is Zoom? Zoom is an application for modern enterprise video communication. Reliable cloud platform for live video and audio class or conference. The first thing to do, you go to your Play Store on your mobile phone, download Zoom Cloud Meeting application. Install this on your phone. When you are done with the, install with the installation, go to your browser, visit zoom.us. When you visit zoom.us, the site will come up and you will sign up. When you sign up, when you sign up, it will ask you to put your part, your email address. But it's preferable for you to sign up with your Google account. When you go with, when you sign up with your Google account, then a link will be sent to that your Google account. You go to your Google account and click on that link. When you click on the link, then it will show you account activate account. When you activate your account. When you activate your account, the already installed Zoom application on your phone will pop up itself automatically and it will show you meet and chat and the following options. When it shows you that, you can click on meeting, you can click on join, schedule, share. On, at the bottom line, we have meet and chat, meeting. If you click on meeting, this is what you have. You have your personal ID. You have chat. You have contact there, as well as settings. If you want to change the setting to suit your taste, you, we come back to meet and chat. We want to set up the class, so you go to the new meeting. When you click on new meeting, then you click on start a meeting. When you click on start a meeting, it depends on the network. It will start loading. Load so you're sure, then you can stop your video if you wish to save your data. Then the next thing to do is to go to your class. You click on that your name at the left bottom left side. Go to participant to add your student. When you click on participant, you take you to this page. You click invite. When you click invite, you can invite your student from google account from gmail you click on gmail your gmail that you use to register with zoom will pop up then you can enter the email the gmail address of whom you want to invite then you send when you send a link will be sent to that email for your student to join the class then you come back you close this come back to meet and chat When you come back to meet and chat, then once if you want to know, once your students join, the number of your participants will increase. Once you click on participant, then once the students have joined, you can share whatever materials you want to take them live. You click on share. If you have any materials to share, you can choose any of the options, whether your screen you want to share or your document. Let me just share a document. I'm going to where the document is stored. Then I will be sharing this Abbas PDF. Then I click on share. Once I click on share, it will load and display. The shared file now is loading. Now, this is the file that I just shared. This file will be seen by my student wherever they have 
while I'm taking them. You can continue by sliding to the next slide, then you take them, whatever you think you can explain. Then, once you are done with what you want to share, you can also open your video. If you are using a big phone or laptop or system, then your, once you click on the video, your video will show. You can be able to see your student. But I'm using a small phone, so you can't see my picture. So that is how to take live class, whether video or audio online. Thank you.